Gelato Passport Plus offers you two methods to calculate overrun. The first is overrun calculation from density estimation. The Passport Plus app calculates the estimated density of the mix. So what you can do is to take any cup and measure its volume. So you fill the cup with water and you weight the amount of the water. Let's say it's a cup of 100 milliliters, meaning that if we weight the amount of water, it's 100 grams. Then when we make our gelato or ice cream, we fill again the same cup until the very top and we weight how much gelato is in our cup. Let's say it's 85. From the density, we estimate an overrun or 28%. If you have the means and you want to be more precise, you can make a completely uh, manual measurement of the overrun. How to do that? You get again a um, cup or a container and you wait first the mix before freezing. It's very important when you wait the mix that it doesn't have any air and any bubble. The best it would be to use a vacuum chamber to remove the bubbles. So let's say our mix in any container, it's 90 grams. And then we make with the same mix, we produce our gelato or our ice cream, and we wait the same container filled this time with ice cream. Let's say that is 80 grams. In this case, it will tell us that the overrun is 13%. So you have two options to calculate overrun. If you use this version, I suggest to do several measurements and use a statistical analysis to make a precise estimation of the overrun.